Good morning. Good morning. Um, I'd like to take just a minute and tell you how thankful I am to uh, have shared this music and some of the stuff with you that is so near and dear to my heart. Um, this song, when I first heard it, I really didn't like it too well. And I thought, ah, that would never be what I'll do, you know. And uh, the more I listened to it, the more the words sunk in. And, you know, words mean things. Um, this, this one comes from Isaiah. Uh, it's Isaiah 40. And, of course, you know, I look at my phone to, to look it up on my Bible and it's not properly. It says, uh, even the youth shall faint and be weary, and the young men shall fall and be exhausted. But they who wait for the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings of eagles. They shall run and not be weary. They shall walk and not be faint. And that is the, uh, the chorus, basically, to this song. And uh, we're doing the, the helmet today, the, the spirit, you know, the helmet of salvation. And, and a helmet protects your head. And, and your brain. And in your brain is all your thoughts, and your brain is all the things that matter to you. Um, and, and you'll find that Satan builds what they call strongholds in your mind, which are things that are bad. Uh, things like, well, I can never sing in church because I'm, I'm too worried about it. You know? and, and every time that thought comes up, that's what comes in your head every time. Or I can never do, you know, I can't speak up at church, or I can't, you know, well, I can't do this because of this. And those strongholds develop over time. And uh, reminding yourself of who God is and what He's done for you and uh, the salvation that has already been won is how you defeat those strongholds and bring those down. And you start building altars in your mind of, of things that, that God has done for you. Well, I know you can help me with this, God, because back then you helped me with this. And I do a lot of that. So this song... Uh, Hopefully, uh, hopefully, uh, will touch you and, and mean something to you. Uh, now, I'm, I'm going to tell you this. I have a tendency to rush this song. So, if you see Stephanie doing this to me, it's not because I'm too loud or she wants me to be quiet. Or it's because I'm rushing the song. We've been married 28 years, so I usually do what I'm told. Oh, 
here's a bar where you all got to sing, right? You know I do this every time. Soft, so, you know, we're going to try this one more time. 